Hey everyone, it's Blue Lizard Gel. I'm standing over pig corpses. With flies. Uh, that's disgusting. Hey everyone, <laughs> it's Blue Lizard Jello, and welcome back to Blue Play Steel Rising here in, wait for it, Les Invalides. Huh? I looked that up right before I hit record. Les Invalides. Not less invalids, like I apparently said at the end of the last video or something along those lines. No, um, I'm gonna try and learn a little bit of French while I play this game, yeah. So we are in Les Invalides which is an area in or just outside of Paris with a bunch of museums, and it's known for its rich cultural district. Uh, and apparently that's where we are. It had nothing to do with invalids or invalids or sick people. No, 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 Blue. Les Invalides. Yeah, you're welcome. Anyway, here we are. We are going to spend some essence here, some anima. We have plenty. Uh, let's see. So I can do two levels. Two levels. What do we want to do? Oh, man, it's so tough. I don't want to go exactly, you know, jack of all trades, but I also don't know what kind of items I'm going to get later on that I'm going to want. So I'm kind of thinking of just what is going to be the most universally beneficial. Endurance is always good. In fact, endurance is really, really good, especially because the rapid cooling can be a little bit costly. Uh, let's do one in vigor. And what is agility good for? Good for certain types of attacks, and you can actually switch in between your loadout to see what it would benefit, which I do really, really appreciate. Elemental alchemy is just resistance. I'm not too worried about resistance. Power is good. Durability though, durability is really good. And that would bring me up to 310 with more balance. But again, I don't even know what balance does. So maybe just two points in vigor. You know, I think two points in vigor. Normally I don't stack endurance slash stamina, but I think in this level or this game, I'm gonna try and do it now. I do have two keys. I could save up and get one more and then unlock or upgrade one of these. However, I think what I'm gonna do is simply open up all of these. And so it allows four level one modules, which I think is a pretty good idea. Uh, as far as all these go, I still don't have any bronze, bronze ing uh, ingots. I can't speak. Uh, boutique, I don't. Now that's interesting. Are these consumables? Why would I need another compass? So the boutique is expanded as you, I guess, collect items out in the field because uh, it didn't have some of these grenades before. So that's kind of nice. Anything else I really want? Not really. What about equipment? Oh, okay. So now we actually have something new or s some things new. I don't actually know. I didn't look this up. I should have. So I learned that Laz Oh, no. Les Invalides, but I didn't learn this one. Uh, Polignac, that's kind of what I'm going for. Kind of cool looking, actually. I like that frock. The culottes, not so much, maybe. <laughs> the hood is cool, though. I lose a lot of armor, but the hood looks cool. So do the boots. I can only buy one. Err... Yeah. I'm going to do the boots. I'm actually going to do the boots. I think that's a good idea. I would love to have purchased those, but I did. But you know what? Actually, how many... Let's go back to my quick access belt. How many of the essence? We have three of these. Brings me up to 750. 830 total, which means I could buy one of these. An endurance module or a will to live. I think I'll do endurance. Let's buy that, and then nothing here. Right, so let's hop out. Let's take a look. First off, I do want to switch, not that. I want to switch out my boots for the Pauline, Paulignac Boots and Gators, just because it looks really cool. I like the, bulk, the uh, buckles on there. Go over to Modules. So I have Longevity, Avarice, and I can do the Efficiency, and I can do the Endurance. Of course, I can't use the Stable Charging, because that's a level two. Although, what does this do? This module moderately increases balance during charge attacks. I don't know what balance does. Unless, I wonder if balance is some sort of poise hyper armor amalgamation, right? Because if you're in a charge attack and this increases your balance, maybe it's harder for enemies to knock you out of that. That very well could be right. So, I still have my compass. So, what are we trying to do here? We are looking for Vakinson's workshop, which is only 93 meters that way, which you know what that means. Oh, we're going to ignore that. <laughs> the death of the dolphin. It's back that way. 
which is blocked. Um, dog is really looking to get a piece of me. So I still have my my little cannon, but I also have the the falchion. And I don't think there was anything back this way, right, that I could do. No. Sadly, performance is running not too wonderfully at the moment. I'm hoping that improves here soon. Really? Can't actually grab that. That's surprising. Okay. Now, do we want to go back to where we could parry? Oh, what is that thing? I don't... Oh, that looks bad. You Somehow you haven't seen me. I kind of do want to go back. And those are fine. I like the Blade Tornado, but... Kind of like the Nemesis Claws with the parrying. Let's try it. Let's go back to it. Are you gonna... I mean, it's just... It's so good. Oh, and that almost immobilized him. Oh, and we have one of these bags we can uh, hopefully cut up if I can actually hit it. There we go. I love that they hit stuff in there. I think that's great. Fulmination grenade. That actually might be an actual beast. Oh, hello. I just hit the target and it found something. Okay, let's go ahead and get you frozen. Alright, good. It's one of those same little snake-like things. A water flask. So what's a water flask for? It's not in my quick access belt? Really? It's a quest item. This flask found in the, oh gosh, Faubor du Gros Caillou contains a pint of clean water. It must belong to a worker at the uh, Les Invalides foundry. Although the, furnace there were, the furnaces were built in the open air, the temperature near them in early summer was almost unbearable. The workers had to drink water constantly to avoid falling ill. So I'm going to find someone who is in desperate need of a drink of water, and I have that for them. Let's keep pushing on. Whoa. These are not actual beasts. No, no. These are uh, these are dogs. Watch the camera there. Oh, they freeze pretty easily, though. One more for him. Okay. You aren't actually... Oh, no. I pulled him too far. Oh, is this going to be like Thymesia? Did they just heal? I bet they did. I bet they did. Oh, they didn't. That's kind of nice. Okay. I need to try and separate you if I can. You guys are acting very odd. There's a nice parry. Oh, and somehow I got them both. That works for me. Now over here. That's going to be blocked, right? Yeah, blocked. Can't go in any of these buildings. Courtyard where I just imagine something's about to drop on my head if I go in there. Uh, let's go up here where the, the puppies were kind of roaming around. Does not appear there's anything in there. Lesser Spirit, free 250 essence, nothing wrong with that. Okay, so how about in here? Ooh, a little cemetery. Somehow you saw me already. That's right, I'll just parry you. That's just crazy how easy that is to pull off. Oh, of course, there it is. Plenty of damage. <laughs> Ordinary vial. Let's go little bit of healing over time. Now, nothing there. Still in the cemetery. You're new. You're very new. I would like to get a uh, backstab on you if I can. Oh, you're going to turn around, though. You're very quick. 
Is there any chance I can hide right here? Nope. Okay. But it seems like just about everything else, you're very weak to frost. Although, my goodness, you seem to have quite a bit of health. Back up. Okay. I, I want to actually see more enemies that don't actually have that weakness, just because otherwise, you know, it's kind of the, uh, the solution to every fight. Okay. Not too bad. 225 for that fight. That wasn't bad at all. Now, were you guarding something, though? Is that supposed to be kind of a mini-boss of sorts? Or I wonder, you know what? This might actually be the way to the laboratory, the workshop. And maybe, uh, you know, if I had just gone straight to it, I would have been stopped. Ooh, okay. Open graves. Kind of gross here. Really poorly modeled, but kind of gross <laughs> regardless. Okay, cobblestone and flame grenade. Kind of thinking I want to backtrack just a little. Let's use the compass. Yeah, see, I think that this is actually the right way. I sidetracked to try and explore, and I think I ended up going the exact way I was supposed to. So instead, we're going to go back to the little courtyard I saw. Okay, more explosive grenades. Can I hop over here? But do I want to? Can you get me? Oh, you can get me if you do that. Come on now. Fire attack. There we go. Heavy? There we go. I really am impressed by how they animated all the different attacks. Several different attacks, and they all look unique. And I, I do appreciate that. I really do. Okay, one more. Switch. Nice heavy. Goodness gracious. Devastating. Oh, yeah. That was worth even more than the last one. Ordinary oil vial. Beautiful. See now. Oh, something to drink. Guess what I have for them? A bronze ingot. Oh, oh no. I have so many cool weapons. I don't know what I want to upgrade. Maybe it'll give me something. Here is something to quench your thirst. Praise be to God. Bless you, whoever you are. Take this for your trouble. Okay. Sure. Petrification grenades. Those could be valuable. I'm really excited about that bronze ingot, though. I wonder how you go about unlocking... Oh! Okay, so when it says blocked, what that really means is it's the old From Software. Hey, it doesn't open from this side. You got to find another way. That's okay. At least I know. Can I sneak around you? Yes, I can. Can I sneak around this dog, though? Like, if I jump over, what's he gonna do? Whole lot. Oh, no. Just kill quick. Okay, that's alright. Freeze them. There we go. Nice. Good. I would say that so far this game is very accessible to new players. It seems very new player friendly. And that's okay. Not every game has to be incredibly difficult. More petrification. Okay, I should probably 
equip those. Something tells me I'm going to want or need them here soon. And can't make it up there, huh? That'd be kind of a fun little jaunt, if you will. All right. Don't just go for that. Look around the corner. Safe? All right. I would also like to go in some of these buildings, but... Oh, well. Okay, so now we've looped around. So far, then, I think we're getting pretty much everything. Maybe some secrets that we're missing. Maybe some hanging bags. But I think we've been fairly thorough. Okay, this is where I got two of those items. There was an open grave. What's over to my right? Not much, believe it or not. That looks like something right there, maybe? Over in that barn? Okay. Let's, uh, let's just go for a parry here. I mean, really and truly just so forgiving. Uh-oh, something else, and I can't see because... Oh, big guy. I don't know if I want to try and uh, parry that. You know what we could be trying is a petrification grenade. That'd be cool. Let's knock him down with our heavy attacks, and then maybe we'll switch over. Well, I can't really switch over because... There's no... Oh, didn't, uh... Didn't get... Oh, that is some damage. See, and I am running out of those those vials. Those al uh, alchemical vials. Go for that. Yep. Oh, walked right into it. Alright, that was on me. That one was on me. <laughs> Come on. Wow, that's... That's got some, uh... Some, uh, cool... Not cool down, but... What am, I trying, what am I trying to say? Recovery time, I guess, is the right word. How about a big one? Finish? Good. Got it. Not too bad. However, when he hits you, when it connects, that hurts. Yeah, these alchemical capsules, they do go quick when you focus on firearms, so I guess that's the balance. Critical repair module and cast iron. That's probably another upgrade level. Critical repair module. Critical attacks to restore a small amount of health. I'm not really getting critical attacks, though. Unless it means backstabs. That could be good, too. So I could switch one of these out. I don't really use this one a lot. Maybe I'll try the critical repair. See if we can get a backstab and see if that counts as a critical. Anything inside these bar? Oh, great. Another shaman... Delacy? Delacy? You know, another another phrase I cannot pronounce for the life of me. And probably somewhere I can't even go anyway, right? Sure appears that way. And, alright. How, uh... How close are we to the workshop? Probably pretty close, right? Oh, actually, this might be a dead end. So I think maybe, in fact, I did have to go straight from the Vestal. Unless I can get over this. Nope, there's something big over there. <laughs> okay, backtracking. Oh. Wait a minute. <laughs> Apparently I missed this. And there are some dogs. You know what we need to do? Oh, wow. You can throw that. Oh, no. The dogs are linked. That's kind of silly. Come this way. There we go. That was a good one. Back up. Oh, that was beautiful. Come on now. Oh. 
He somehow missed. Oh, but you can actually get the parry pretty quick after an attack. That's nice. Do I want to use it? No, I'm going to use another ordinary vial. I would love to get the drop on this guy. Doubt you can. And I doubt I can run up and get it. We'll try. Nope. <laughs> Whoa! If we just go in and in and out like this, we should be okay. Just a couple of hits back up. Maybe we can actually mobilize them. We almost got it. Back up. Oh, actually. Come on, one more. No, get up. I just want to immobilize him. Ah, he's really ruining this. There it is. Well, there's the critical. But I did not get health back. If I did, it was very, very little. Minuscule, even. Hmm. Not so sure about that one. Fire chain and a bronze egg. Is that a weapon? Is the fire chain a weapon? It is. <gasps> okay. The special move is Invocation of Fire. When the chain weapon is placed in contact with the ground, Aegis summons a Thonian Inferno that engulfs the weapon and enables fire attacks. Whoa. Okay. Okay. Yeah. We're going to we're gonna try that. It's little. Oh, it's way little. I wasn't expecting it to be so small. Oh, look at the look at the little butcher station. Gross. <laughs> hey, people gotta eat. I get it. I get it. Okay, item right there. That's the dead end. All right. Well, hopefully we can get a shortcut back to the vestal because I'm sitting on quite a bit of essence right now. You're gonna see me though, right? I assume. an item back there? No, just some glow from some fire somewhere. Let's get some grenades on. Uh, what do I want? My inventory. Quick access belt. Uh, let's put on... Explosive? No. Where's the... Petrification. I have so many of these. Put that there. Can I grab? Yes. Oh, perfect. Let's see if I missed it. I had it and I missed it. All right, well, let's get fire going. It's actually just going to kill him outright, I think. Oh, well. <laughs> I do like that. Oh, see a big guy there. Oh, it's the guy with the ball and chain, too. Is he solo though? He might be solo. Oh, you're... At least... I don't think the big guy... Oh, the other big guy saw me, so I can potentially pull him? Or are you just gonna stay there? Oh, come on. Well, in that case... Can I... Can I actually get your attention since you'll chase me? You won't. You're just going to hide behind your little gun. I know that's exactly what I was doing, but so what? Okay. I want to use my grenades. Um. Oh, wow. Look how much that filled it. <gasps> Whoa. Okay. So that was a critical. That missed, though. It's weird that it doesn't have, like, any splash or anything. Okay, that comes some health back. It's... You know what, though? I need to imbue with fire. That has some good impact, too. Yeah, like, really good. No, nope, back here. Oh, watch it. Almost got him. I'd like to get the fire going. And we're not going to get it. Nope. Still not. Okay. You're not dead. How are you not? There we are. 
Oh, okay. Well, now we'll go get you. Right? Are you stuck for some reason? Okay, let's get some fire then. Oh, I bet that's an attack too. Like, I'm not really using it as such, but I bet I could. Okay. Oh, get up, get up, get up. And you're on fire. That'll kill you. Great. Let's go back. Let's collect some goods. I think there is... Did I grab this item? Oh, there's also that bag that I should be able to get, right? Maybe. That's really high. We should be able to hit that, right? If my flaming mace can actually get it? Come on. Do I have to have a blade of some sort? I mean, that would almost make sense. Let's try the falchion. There we go. I I think that was just coincidence, though. I don't think I needed to do that. But where... It almost looks like there's an item. Nope. Just light behind that. I thought I saw... I guess I... Oh, it was the one on the cart that I just grabbed. Never mind. Okay, really, really bright fire. Can I break a statue? No. Nor would I want to. So we can actually come... Whoa! I actually had the wrong weapon equipped. Otherwise, I wouldn't have used that. Oh, that's alright. Come on now. Can you attack? Double? There we go. And you're dead. 2700 anima. I don't want to lose that. Hopefully we're close to either the shortcut or to the workshop. Ooh, Valiant Spirit. Should be good anima. Is this an actual treasure chest? No, just a box. Okay. Moving forward. Wait. Up here then? All right, I like the verticality here. Oh, it's not verticality. I'm just going inside. <laughs> I was complaining that I couldn't go in the houses, so... Probably should bite my tongue with that. Musket and culottes, musket and shoes and gaiters. I don't really care about the culottes, I'm going to be honest. Should we use the compass? Let's check it out. Wait, how? How is the workshop so far away now? That doesn't seem to make sense. I mean, I, I don't think I've gone that far. And really, at this point, what I want is <laughs> I want a shortcut back. Uh, I'm going to use actually an oil vial. Suddenly very quiet. I see the big guy over there. Already sees me. Okay. Anyone else hiding back here? Or is this place I can, you know, make Custer's last stand? Oh, wait a minute. What was that? Blocked. Okay. Wasn't even expecting to check that. It's almost like they put this here so you can sneak up. Oh, there's a dog, though. I need to pull the dog. Okay, dog. Oh, dog plural. Dog plural. Oh, getting stuck, though. Back up. Just go for the quick kill, if at all possible. There we go. Come on now. That's fine. All right. And now it's just you. 
What was? What is this? Oh, it's a note. Don't read that. Uh, people of Paris, <laughs> Louis, King of France, and Navarre, by the grace of God, declares that the representatives of the Third Estate gathered in an illegal assembly continue to propagate seditious and criminal ideas. It was to put an end to this unrest that the Estates General were dissolved. Alas, some Parisians, led astray by the prescribed representatives, thought it right to take up arms against this just decree. Adequate measures were taken to suppress this violence, order was promptly restored, and the majority of the perpetrators were apprehended. In order to ensure the safety of his subjects, His Majesty has decreed that the population must remain in their homes until further notice. The following measures are hereby adopted until further notice. Any person circulating in the streets without authorization will be neutralized immediately. Anyone suspected of aiding fugitives will be imprisoned and interrogated. The enforcement of these measures is entrusted to the command of His Majesty's mechanical army. Bit tyrannical if you ask me. Okay. I don't have a whole lot of health right now. So, oh jeepers. It would probably behoove me to heal at some point. Back up. And heavy. There we go. Got him. Good, good. Oh, there's an item right there, but there's lots of enemies. Urgh, I just want to make it back now. <laughs> I feel so exposed being this far away. Although, is that... Really? No. You don't have to jump down, but there's the item. So let's go clear the courtyard before we jump. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, that could have been really, really bad. Let's use a burette. Okay. You want to go ahead and... Do fire? Yep, that's perfect for me. Because I can do my little tornado, which is... Oh, I love that move. Back up. And... Gotcha. So you pop through there. Oh, that's actually where I was going to... Oh, so if I dropped down, you probably would have ambushed me pretty quick. I just hope that I'm making, you know, <laughs> making my way back to the beginning. I could go and get the backstab there, or the uh, sneak attack. Let's check it out up here, though, see if there's anything, anything hiding. There's a gate that maybe I could open for a shortcut, I don't know. Oh, dogs. You know what we can try? Little, little tornado, go. Actually, that was really bad because I just split my damage. There's one. And not too bad. We're learning the dogs a bit better. They're not they're not the worst. They're not the best. Okay. Oh look at that! Oh! Whoa, 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 whoa! We've done a huge loop. A huge loop. Which means. That doesn't make sense. <laughs> it did say the workshop was up here, right? I also don't really want to rest. Just because I don't want to... I don't want to get everything to be reset. Back up. Okay, got the kill there. We're just gonna kind of check out this area. Since it, uh, since this was originally where it said the workshop was, but I guess I was supposed to go up here and realize, oh, I can't get through. And I could have just totally unlocked that, couldn't I have? Yeah. Do I want to? Hmm. It might be beneficial. I don't know if I'm going to have to come through this area again. It could be a good idea, though, before I go and take on that courtyard coming up. That shouldn't be too far, right? Let's do it. Let's go back. I kind of like the cooldown mechanic. I got to be honest. I I think that it's it's a worthwhile attempt to subtly punish negative stamina. You know, other games the biggest penalty is that you can't you can't do anything right away. You know, you actually have to kind of wait a minute before you're able to use stamina again. But it's oh, I dropped down though. 
I'd have to go all the way around, I think. Never mind. Let's hope we don't have to come this way again. Right? Right? Uh Yeah, I just Someone's coming. Oh no. No. Another one of those evil machines. Do not fear. I mean you no harm. Ah! It speaks too. Get out of here, you damn pile of scrap metal. Hmm. I I don't know. I don't know if there's a quest there or if it's just flavor text. It could be. Okay, well. Let's proceed. So this is where we could have jumped down and the little snake-like creature could have ambushed me, I believe. So here, we definitely don't want to fight too many enemies if we can help it. So what I'm going to do instead, hopefully, is wait till the uh, ball and chain guy trolls back. Can I get up these rocks without jumping, though? I feel like as soon as I drop, I'm, I'm just toast. Oh, maybe not. Okay. You are? Oh, you're actually a ball and chain, too. And now we have both. Okay. Um, I think... Watch it. Alright. Can I get the uh, critical? There we go. Oh, I just did a critical with my gun. That was amazing. So let's finish you. Get up there. Okay, you're dead, and now move. Oh, that was... I'm doing that again. That was just fun. Okay, and then critical with the gun. <laughs> Amazing! Right into a freeze. Okay, a couple of heavies. Oh, that was really fun. Oh, that was... Big range. Yikes. Actually, keep doing that. That's that's completely acceptable to me. Okay. Ooh, nice. He has some really fast recovery from that move. Yeah, it's almost like that's a combo. Oh, boy. 3,800 <laughs> essence. I should go rest. I don't want to. I don't want everything coming back. <laughs> Famous last words. Ooh, module key. If I had saved that. Oh, printed song lyrics. A tribute to the Marquis de Lafayette by Monsieur D. To the tune of Avec les Jeux dans les Vianches. When Lafayette commands, we enter as one aloud. All of Paris calls for him, and everyone sings out. His name alone is worth a dozen, and if some danger were to call, with a hero at our gates, how could we fear it all? Printed in Paris by Citizen Memoro. Price. Three denier. Beautiful, probably. Probably lovelier if you can actually, you know, speak French. However, and alas, that is not me. Plenty of spirit. That is not lacking. And, oh, and we get to upgrade a weapon. Right? Oh, I need a tool to break this. Yeah, I need a tool to break this. Ah, okay. So obviously I'm going to get some, it's, there's probably some Metroidvania type deals here. Oh, you have a flaming weapon. Let's see what you do. Is it just a flaming axe? That's a rather large swing. Probably a ton of damage on that. I want to see what else you do. You just picked up your own arm. Okay. I'm trying to give you an opportunity to attack. That's it, huh? Back up. Okay, not that wasn't too bad. Your body just went somewhere. Uh, we're getting so far away from my Vestal. Another note here. Dear Jacques, I have been waiting for you for over an hour and cannot wait any longer. They are fighting at the 
invalid. No more than 60 yards from where I stand now, I will not stand idly by and watch my countrymen die. My pistols are loaded and the makeshift bridge we built will hold long enough for me to reach them. I hope you will be able to find me soon and join the fight alongside us. If by misfortune you arrive too late, please be so kind as to commend my soul to God, your brother Laurent. Sounds like a rather uh, dark time in their lives right now. Okay, what's my healing situation? I have one oil. Oh gosh, one oil vial and one oil burette. That's... That's not great. Like, if we're, if we're taking inventory right now, which I, I clearly just did, this is... This is not good news. Okay, flame grenades. Probably should be using more consumables. I love my petrification grenades, though. They are just... They are the bee's knees. Okay, now that's back to the vessel, right? Yes, it is. And I've already gone in here. Uh, I wouldn't even have to kill that many things to go back, right? I'm playing a dangerous game. A, a dumb game. Just a really, really stupid, foolish game here. Okay. Got the one. I have a treasure. Look up in the tree. Oh, I see you. Go ahead and fall down. There we go. Thank you. There we go. Nice and easy. Good clean kill. That's what we're looking for here. <laughs> I just, I love that. That's one of my favorite things. Oh, another oil vial. It's one of my favorite things about this game. That you see a, a bag hanging in the tree and you cut it open and there's something in it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, grade two charging efficiency, so that's going to be wait, do I have, do I already have one of those? Is that my second? I think that's my second one. Hold on. I do have two of those. Oh no, stable and efficient. Okay. This is just balance during charge attacks. This is increases physical damage by a successful fully charged so those would work really really well especially because I do actually like the charge attacks they're very powerful plus they just they look so cool okay any others in the trees okay let's do a double charge because it's fun oh wow and knocked him down for the easy kill oh this saber weapon falchion and saber really really effective you know, if I have a boss, though, <laughs> we're in trouble. Yes, I know, obviously, that's where the game wants me to go, which is why we're not going there. Lots of grenades. Oh, man. The game is kind of prepping me, it seems. Oh, wait. Can you really just walk through that? You can just walk through that. See, this, this looks like a boss. Doesn't it? Does it not? I, uh, I don't know. Let's go for it. Esplanade de Invalide. This, oh gosh, I can't even say it anymore. You know what I mean. <laughs> okay. Another ordinary oil vial, though. I think what I want to do, though. Just in case I am about to fight a boss, I would actually like to get the fire chain back on. We'll freeze them, and then we'll set them on fire. And, and... Hmm. We only have two more petrification grenades. How about... Flame grenade... Well... How about explosive? Because that's just straight damage. That's just really good physical damage. Okay, big guy. Should be able to take you out, no problem, right? Let's actually set this one on fire. Ow. No, don't spin. Okay, back 
acá. Oh, good clap, good clap. It's so hard, it's not fast enough to set him on fire, unless he just has some really good fire resistance, which he may. Tell you what, let's freeze him. There we go. And now, nice charge attack. Wow, that was good. Kill him? Nah. Alright, that was that was sloppy. The fire buildup wasn't great, but he might just be resistant. Can't really blame the tool if he's already resistant. Not going that way. Cut to the middle. Very bloodborne with all the carriages. Maybe that's just, you know, me being wishful thinking. Yo, don't even pretend like you're not about to come alive. Get out of here. Come on. Just hurry up and do it. You know you're going to. I just don't know what's going to trigger you. Really? Okay. Color me surprised. Anything on the other side of this wall? Not really. Just another one of you, huh? Well, tell you what. You haven't seen me. Stop running. Quickly, quickly, quickly. Nah, that didn't work. <laughs> Watch it. Oh gosh, I couldn't get up in time. If we just keep tagging, maybe we can get the fire. Kind of almost have it, right? No, he's a little over half. Well, that's gonna hurt. Oh, no, it didn't. Somehow. He's, uh, I don't know where he's aiming. Hey, we actually got him on fire. Let's see how well that does. It's slow. Oh, through the hedges. It, it's keeping him going, though. I wonder if I could actually put him out with my, uh, fire gun. I'm not going to. What would the point of that be? Yeah, that's a good long while. Not bad. Just had to, you know, duck and weave. Little tag and then just get out of there. I know, is it too soon to ask for another Vestal though? Oh, gosh, another one. Can you, can you just walk through the hedges? Yes, you can. <laughs> they just don't exist. <laughs> All right. Make this easier. Frozen. Let's light him up. All right. Watch it. Okay, we got him. There, he's on fire. Good. Back up. The fire damage would actually kill him at this point, but it would just be slow. There we go. Sprint attacks are pretty cool. Look at that. That little flip with the uh, spinning ball of fire. Yeah, it's weird that you can just walk through this. Is it this? Is it going to be this item that makes you wake up? No? Oh, two more of those. I'm... I'm just not convinced. <laughs> I'm still not convinced that these things aren't going to just come to life. It's a rather large zone, isn't it? All right, just through the main main gate. Eugene de Valkinson's workshop. I'm at the workshop. Don't know what that's going to mean. Probably a cutscene of some sort. I just need to find a way in from the outside. Because I can't just jump up there, really? It's not even that far. There's stairs here. He barely blocked it. <laughs> Diane, breaches and shoes and gated. Those breaches might be kind of cool. 
Uh, yeah, they're studded. Done. Uh, do I like this? I still like the uh, the boots and gaiters. Yeah, I still like those. Can't do it. Come on, how would I not be able to get through that? Why would I even give up so so quickly? All right, I think I'm just gonna have to go outside and do a little hardcore parkour. Oh, there's a vestal. Oh, there's a vestal. Notice I just ignored it though. Like, why did I do that? <laughs> why am I out here? Mostly I just wanted to unlock some doors, or this door at least. Not that I think I really need to. Okay, yeah, let's let's go rest. We have nearly 5,000. That's pretty cool. So I think before we level, I wanna choose an item to level up, and I'm not even sure which one I wanna do. I don't really wanna use the ice batons currently since the ice gun is just so, so good. Uh, let's go to equipment. No, it's upgrades, that's what we want. Do have one module key that's useless. So let's see. The Falchion Saber is amazing. This would go up by 11 points of damage. Uh, better impact, better immobilization, better, better physical, better... Yeah, that's really good. This only goes up by 4 points, the Nemesis Claws. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Okay, I see. But the counterattack goes up pretty significantly. Oh, and I didn't notice it has such huge impact. Look at that impact. That's massive with the parry. Ooh. I do have two bronze ingots. I forgot about that. So let's do, let's, I want, definitely want to do Nemesis Claws. Oh, look at that. So now it's two bronze ingots and a cast iron. But I also want to do, I think, the Falchion Saber? The special move is, is pretty beefy once you level that up. But I think... Uh, you know what? Do we want it? No. I'm going to do Falchion. Falchion Saber. Burette, we have nothing to do just yet. But now we can upgrade. Okay, so now what do we want to do? Well, nothing currently. Because what I want to do is actually switch that out since I'm not using... What I'm going to do is I'm going to put on the Falchion Saber and the Nemesis Claws so when I go to level up, I can see which ones are going to be directly impacted. See? Okay, thinking this through. So right now, the Falchion Saber, it would be benefited by power a little bit. And agility, most of all. Nemesis Claws, agility, and that's it. So actually, agility is definitely a good idea. I might put a couple of points into... Oh, I can't. Oh, I ran out very quickly. Yikes. Uh, let's go to Boutique, though. Let's sell. I want to sell all of the essences that I have. So that's enough for another level. And do we want another point in agility? I think I kind of do. But I wouldn't also be mad about more health, too. Oh, and I have another... Okay, now we'll do another one. There we go. Okay. Perfect. And Boutique, you are showing something... Oh, I can just purchase the Valiant Spirits now. Right. Okay. That feels pretty good. That feels pretty good. Um, you know, I'm going to actually leave these. I'm going to not rely on the gun for now. And now I guess we're trying to make our way up. I see the scaffolding over here. Oh, but I can't get up there what about this little this little contraption right here no no interaction what does he have okay some pretty cool looking automatons right there how am I supposed to get up she said I have to find a way from the outside. Well, I found some some possibilities. Oh, maybe I'm going to have to climb up a different building and eventually get up there. That platform kind of looks like it's supposed to drop. Okay. 
gate is locked. It just said unlock. I know it's locked. I know that it's locked because the text said unlock. The opposite of which would be to lock. Game. All right. I guess I have to go through the factories. But you know, we're not going to get too far into this because we only have a couple minutes. So I'm actually going to call it a part there. So still interesting. Still some performance issues that need to be addressed. And again, hopefully the day one patch will fix that. This is still actually me playing just a little bit before the game itself comes out so there's definitely a chance for day one patches or even uh, post day one patches which would be day two and beyond patches <laughs> but that is going to do it thanks so much for watching hope you're enjoying me play through steel rising a very interesting game with some even more interesting fashion but some really well done visuals in terms of the uh the the movement that the tech the uh, animations is the word i'm struggling to find <laughs> but thanks so much for watching hope you're enjoying and i'll see you next time.